Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you. And some crazy pets. Luna's here visiting. We'll see if she comes over. Uh, yes, so it is Saturday. It is so hot out. It's like in the 90s, I think, today. So we'll stay inside. All right, so I've got a Dollar Tree haul for you. It's a pretty decent one. Um, we'll start. I found these, which are like a brown with a green kind of tinge to them. Placemats, they're the fabric. I know some people make pillows out of these. Um, I'm putting them on my end tables in my bedroom. And I thought these would be perfect. So I grabbed two. They would make nice pillows. They are with the fall stuff. The, um, not, well, yeah, fall, but the, uh, sunflower stuff. And they had them in a green too, but I really liked the brown. So I grabbed two of those. Um, in the craft section, I found this wreath, but look at the edge. Isn't that pretty? It's much thicker and it almost feels braided. It's much thicker. I might spray paint this. I don't know. We'll see. For a fall wreath. And I thought maybe spray painting it like a brown, like a darker, richer color or staining it or something, but we'll see. Um, so yeah, this is just the willow wreath, but it just seems thicker than before. And I like the braiding on it. It's super pretty. So I grabbed one of these. Um, this has stuff in it, but I grabbed this Rubbermaid tote in the navy blue. I really like this color. It's just, a uh, not a Rubbermaid. It's, uh, Bella storage solution is the name of it and what I'm gonna store in here is one for when I go on vacation next year and I was at Target today and they had a bunch of samples which won't go on vacation with me but so they gave us some samples and they were calling this a sample now this has got to be hair glue in the 1.25 ounce I use this every day I pay four dollars for this size at CVS and they were giving them away as a sample and these are great to travel with so I got one and my niece got one for me because again I use it to like spike my hair when I do my hair and these are perfect for vacation I was so excited I don't have to like spend four dollars on one so I got two of those today and then in the coupon thing they had some of these scunchy elastics that are like rubbery I don't know about all that for hair but I'll see if my little cousin would like them or her girlfriends. They were just giving them away in the little sample section. Oh, and then I found for my bullet journal these maps of the United States. These are actually for license plate game. They were a dollar and you get 40 sheets, but I'm going to cut the map out and glue it into my bullet journal and mark all the states I've been to. So I just thought that was fun. I would show you. I found or bought um, some of this Baker's twine in the pink, the lime green, and the purple for now. Thought that was fun. I like this Baker's twine to decorate and to make crafts and stuff. And these are great. Just a small amount. Or for baking, it's fun to tie things up. So I grabbed a three-pack of that. Um, in the section of crafts, I also found these. <sighs> the cats are wrestling again. Boys! Now they're not crazy cats. Come here, Alex. Um, I found these. Look at the pastels. I think they are so fun, but I really think that this would be fun to fill an ornament with instead of the white snow. I don't know. Just filling them with like these pastels. They're super cute, but we'll see. They made me happy, so I bought them. And these are, I don't know. It doesn't say how many ounces they are, but they remind me of like cereal. Yeah, so I thought those were fine, and they matched that pastel. Um, I found the wall hooks. They had all of them, but I just grabbed this one cactus. Um, I think what I'm going to do is hang it on my wall in my bedroom and hang some necklaces from it. Um, I don't need anything too heavy. It does have the sawtooth hook on it, and then this is pretty sturdy, and it's a nice heavy plastic. It's like a... The back is like that MDF board, but the front is almost like it's shellacked on there. Anyway, so I got one I thought would be perfect just to hang some longer necklaces on that I have. Oh, my shoulder hurts today. 
very sore and very swollen. I don't know what I did, but it hurts. So I grabbed one of those. I and mean, if I had a little girl or a little girl's room, I would have got the mermaid, but I don't. Um, I picked up for a couple reasons. These are nine pack hook and loop cable ties. So what you do, if you have a lot of like electrical cables somewhere, you can wind them all up and use these to hold them, which is perfect um, for like my sewing machine outlet plugs are all in a box, like a storage container and my Cricut. So I'm gonna separate them all and tie them off with these. But these are also good for travel, for your um, cords on your curling iron, your hair dryer, or your chargers. Um, these are great for that as well. So I probably will throw a couple in my travel tote for when I go on vacation, just to keep things kind of under control. Um, so yeah, these are great. I don't think I've seen these before. I don't think they're new. I just don't think I ever noticed them, but these are great. So I grabbed some of those. Um, also for my bedroom, I grabbed this elephant. Look at it. Isn't that so sweet? I love this elephant and it says simplify your life. I'm either going to keep it like this, and I got two of these, or I'm going to rip the elephants off and put them on my wall in between all my circular wicker stuff. So we'll see. I mean, I like this just to sit out, but I have a lot of just sitting stuff. I could also just hang it on the wall, which that would work as well. But I have two of them because I wasn't exactly sure what I was going to do. So I picked up two just to be on the safe side. And I love that olive color and this, oh, I love this. It's so classy and simple and clean and I love it. So I grabbed two of those. Um, I ran across some of these lights. These are called Floral Garden Copper Wire Lights. And at Christmas time, you know, these are great to have and I never really find them. So generally when I see them, I'll pick up one or two. These are the copper. And you put a couple batteries and you and they wind around things and because these are metal they'll stay you don't have to like glue them and they're not super thick and if you can see in there it's a very fine copper wire and they work pretty good so I grabbed a set of those just to put in with my Christmassy stuff um, I grabbed some more shower caps um, I grabbed four more and now I think I have enough for Sarah and I for vacation next year um, look at those, they have ice cream cones on them. And if you were, didn't watch my other Dollar Tree haul, I used these to put shoes in inside my luggage. And I know I can get plastic ones cheaper, but I'm thinking long-term use, just keeping them for, you know, in with my travel. I have a, like a big tote that I keep all of my travel stuff in, and I will put these in there. And whenever I go on vacation, I'll just grab one or two, depending on how many pair of shoes I pack, and stick them in there. So I grabbed four more, so now I have a total of six. So probably three for me, three for Sarah, or just depending on how many shoes we pack. We'll have plenty of those. These work really well, too, if you need a shower cap. I don't need a shower cap, but these are super cute. So I grabbed just a few more, so I will have them. And I'm going to, on a small, I mean, it's not small. I'm going to Florida yeah, a couple weeks, and... Um, I'll use those for that as well. All right, before I get into one other thing I wanted to show you, I've got a small giveaway. Um, there's a company, it's called Cardly. They're on Amazon, it's C-A-R-D-L-Y. And what these are, you stick them on the back of your cell phone. This one has um, like a ring to hold it up, but it, you put your credit card, ID, money, chapstick, whatever, because some of them, like this one here, is stretchy. And the company sent me some, so I wanna share them, share some with you. Um, I have these two. I'm gonna give away one of, you know, one of these. This is a pink one, and this is a black one. I'm gonna give away one of these, which is stretchy. And I have, oh, here's another one that's stretchy that's in the marble. So yeah, I'm gonna do a quick drawing. And what you'll need to do is comment below if you would like to be entered into the drawing. See, these are stretchy, so like a house key or chapsticks. So here's Luna. Lipstick. What you doing, Alex? 
the cat. I thought someone was breaking into my house. It's the cat on the chair behind me right over here. Come on, Alex. Anyway, so I'm doing a giveaway. Comment down below if you'd like to win one. It'll be totally random. And I will announce, like, next week the winner. And you'll email me, and then I will mail you out one. And they're super fun. And what happens is you peel the back off. Clean your phone with some alcohol. You peel the back off. It's really sticky. But then if you want to take it off your phone, you peel it off. The case. I wouldn't stick it on your phone. And you can, the sticky comes off. So, yeah. So, I have a variety of ones that I was, that I was sent. Um, and if you want to look, check them out, go on to Amazon. It's C-A-R-D-L-Y is what they're called. And they've got a lot of them out there. And they're just little phone holders. It says it fits all smartphones and cases, comfortably holds three cards, no sticky residue when removed. So if you'd like to win one, comment below that you would like to be entered and I will do a drawing for that. Stop. This dog is crazy. She keeps licking me. All right. All right. This is Luna. She is my niece's dog. No, I don't have a dog. I've got two crazy cats. I'm just dog sitting today and she's wound up because Alex is rustling behind me. Okay. All right. And she's a Chihuahua Terrier mix. All right. Lay down. Now, I wanted to show you also that I went to Half Price Bookstore Warehouse Sale. I feel like there's Half Price Bookstores all over the country, not just here, but... Um, in June at the fairgrounds, they offer a warehouse sale, warehouse sale, where most books are $2, records were a dollar, and paperbacks were 50 cents. And it was super exciting. I love going. Um, we, it's usually Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Uh, this year we didn't make it till Sunday. Usually we go on Friday, but I want to show you what I picked up. And if you haven't gathered yet, I love Christmas. So I got Kenny Rogers Christmas record. Um, in at the holidays, I pull out my record player and I play lots of Christmas music. So I got a Kenny Rogers, and I got Perry Como sings Merry Christmas music. How fun is that? I know. I might be a goober, but I did get two records. Um, they were pretty picked over by the time I got there. And then for 50 cents, I picked up Laurel K. Hamilton. I love her. She writes the Anita Blake books. They're vampire hunter books and Mercy Thompson, which are more like fairy books. Um, this one is novellas. Um, it's a new Anita Blake vampire hunter tale. So they're just little stories in here. But I love the Anita Blake books. I don't know which. Oh, Blood Upon My Lips is the Laurel K. Hamilton one. I don't know when this came out. But it was regularly $7.99 and I paid 50 cents for it. I'm looking for a, oh, July of 2004. It's there, it's an old book, but I've not read it. So it was 50 cents, I grabbed that. Um, I picked up, oh, Christine Feehan, I love her. And this is her, Samurai Games, which is a series I haven't read. I'm not even sure what book this is in the series. Um, but I will find out. It was 50 cents. Let me see here. Oh, Samurai Game is the first book. Yay! In a series, and I haven't read it yet. So, I needed some new series to read. I love series. It anyway, so I grabbed that. And this is in good shape for 50 cents. If you've ever been to Half Price Books... They're half price. Um, this was $7.99, like I said, regularly. So if I went to half price, it would be $4. And you can sell books there as well. So I grabbed that for 50 cents. And I need to read that. And then I picked up, and I was shocked to see this book. This is also Christine Feehan. This is um, the Carpathian series, which is another type, like vampire type book. That I'm, I love this series. I've read all the books in it. I don't own all the books, but I have read and listened to all the books. But this one came out in 2017, so I'm not exactly sure why it was there. It's a hardback book. It was regularly 
$27 and I got it for $2 and I don't think I think I listened to this book but I don't think I read it so and I reread these books so I grabbed that because I enjoyed this book and um, yeah so it's a nice big book and it was two dollars so that's all I picked up um, Sarah my niece I've talked about her and that's her dog she's a high school English teacher and she teaches 11th and 12th grade so she picked up a lot of books for her students she's building a library in her classroom of books she thinks they would just be interested in borrowing and reading so she's doing that in her classroom so she got a lot of books um, but that was it. So don't forget, comment below if you would like to win one of these um, cardleys for your phone. And they're pretty neat. And they hold your card pretty tight. I've checked them out. I tried one and my work friends have tried one. And they hold your card very tight. So you're not going to lose it, your ID or your credit card if you're out and about. So if you'd like to win one, let me know. I will um, announce the winner in an upcoming video. And then, like I said, you email me your address and I will mail one out to you. All right, everybody. Well, thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great week. Bye. Bye. Come here, Luna. Come here. Say bye. Oh, oh, you talk to the people. She's got a liquor problem. She has a liquor problem. Have a good one. Bye.